Guys, how are you all? I hope you are doing beautifully. Today, tonight, this morning, whatever time it is for you, I wanted to talk to you about joy, about happiness, about human flourishing. You know, it seems to me that to be happy is to somehow feel content with how things are, in some sense. To build any form of resistance to the facts or to, to the circumstances in which you live is to, is to live in chaos. And I think that is probably the root of most human anxiety uh, in many ways. It's sort of a, sort of a reacting, a constant sort of reactance to, to not, not really accepting maybe it is how you feel or how another person feels. Sort of like being locked into a subjective sort of ruminative state where you're not really grounded in any type of true lasting sense of good or sense of hope. <clears throat> you know, happiness is different than joy. Happiness we can understand in light of sort of hedonic pleasure, right? You know, some people experience more pleasure than others, but what I'm talking about is something deeper, something that is bound up with things like gratitude. Um, and acceptance and non-judgmental uh, sort of acceptance of, of how things are. But I dare to say that we must not simply not judge the world. We, <clears throat> I think we are called to be judgmental because we are rational beings in some sense. Why else would we have the capacity to judge if there wasn't any type of order to be observed within maybe law or within community? You know, I think we are rational animals, but our rationality can limit us. I think true happiness is sort of allowing ourselves to be rational in submission to something that goes beyond us, beyond our ability to understand. And it is when we are okay with this reality, we can begin to perhaps realize that no matter what happens, everything is going to be okay. We must separate ourselves from outcomes. We must not define ourselves purely by what it is we can do. Who we are, there's something about who we are that is innately good and that is intrinsically valuable. And we will not see this unless we give ourselves the opportunity to be, to be okay with how we are, or at least to see how we are, to see ourselves in an honest way. And I think this is being authentic, and it's really what, what opens up the world to me, what gives me kind of an ultimate sense of somehow being content. Uh, and I think this relates to my desire to be more of a simple person. I think we all need to be more simple and we all need to be discerning of that sort of reality that, that is calling us to be perhaps not content with what we have today. We must take a step back and realize that we have much more than we need in many ways. We must order our bodily desires in that respect because I think the mind follows in suit when we do that. So this video is about happiness and joy. You know, they're, they're very different things. So go after what lasts, what gives you lasting peace, joy, gratitude. Build committed relationships. Let me know what you think. Subscribe if you want to see more from me and like the video. Take care, you guys.